So I thought I'd start this vlog off with a little updated skincare routine because it's been a while and things have actually changed in the skincare cupboard, shall we say. So you guys might have seen on my Instagram, which if you didn't, you have severely missed out because I don't think I can express my love for these products more without sounding like it really is such a paid ad. Now I am in collaboration with Skin and Me here and I want to disclaim that, but I have i'm literally baffled like baffled by how much these products have transformed my skin and you guys know that i don't talk about anything i don't completely love but i feel like in this day and age it's really hard to get across just how genuinely i love a product because obviously there's so much false advertisement out there but i just want you guys to know like these products have transformed my skin and like I am telling everyone, I've told my sister to do it, I've told all the people in the SLA office to get onto it, I cannot hype these products up enough. Like, you guys know I've spoken about my skincare journey a couple of times on here, and the breakouts that I was getting off coming off the pill were just so, just, it wasn't my skin and I didn't know what to do because I was so used to having clear skin. And I just feel like I finally, I finally found something that's actually working. And it's just something you can use at home. You know, there's no crazy expensive price tags. You don't have to go and have like, you know, you don't have to go and book an appointment and fit it into a schedule. This is an at-home thing that actually works. So now I've done my little spiel about this and just I basically want you guys to realize that this is more than just a collaboration. This is me completely obsessed with these products. Um, I'm gonna explain to you if you did miss what Skin and Me are, is about, um, I'm just gonna explain to you what they are. So basically, when you sign up to Skin and Me, when you go onto their website, you fill out a personalized questionnaire which basically you let them know your skin concerns, you know, the sort of things that you are looking to get from the skincare product. And then they personalize this little daily doser, which comes like this. It's also got your name on it, which I just feel like really excites me. And inside here, this contains active ingredients that you can't buy over the counter, which I think is probably why this is making such a difference because it's actually got stuff in there that's doing something, you know, that's really working. And I'll just put in this picture here. So this was my skin three weeks before I started Skin and Me. And my skin honestly cleared up in like three weeks just by using the daily doser. So you use this only at night. So it's got this sort of like level along the side sort of show you when it's finishing. Um, and you twist that and then you get like a little click and then it will click and that's your like dose done for the day. Um, and it's like a month's worth in there and then you get your new one at the end of the month ready for the new month. The best thing about the sort of personalization aspect of Skin and Me is because it's designed by dermatologists it takes like the guesswork out of we you know when you go on and you're presented with all these different skincare products and you're just looking at it thinking i don't know which one i should buy you're standing in a shop and you're like oh they're all saying they're going to do these things but what's actually going to work being able to actually go on and click your skin concerns and like you know really tell someone exactly what you're hoping to achieve and then have that ingredient put into a skincare so you know that's exactly what's going to happen to me is just like how this is such a clever idea, honestly, like, mind blown. Anyway, they have also just recently launched their, these launched in April, I mean, I'm really severely, these are like, <laughs> I've been using these for the last, like, month, I've barely got anything left, but they're so good. Um, so this is their brand new, so this is the Purify and Prep Hydrating Cleanser. This is the Soothe and Smooth Light Moisturizer, so this one's got hyaluronic acid in it, which you guys know I'm obsessed with, so lots of hydration going on here. But to be honest, this is the best thing about the skin and me, is that now this is literally my skincare, uh, which makes it an absolute dream when it comes to traveling, because this is basically all I take away with me, and an eye cream, and a facial, and a facial oil really, but that's it. So these ones I just use in the morning, so I use the cleanser, and then I use the moisturizer, um, and then I put some sun cream on, and that's like my morning routine. And then in the evening, I do the cleanser, then I use the daily doser, and then I do the moisturizer. So just to give you a little bit more information on the cleanser, th this is a non-foaming cleanser, which is the best. And it's, it's sort of almost like a gel cream consistency. It's really nice, it feels super, super smooth when it's actually on your face. Um, and it also helps to retain your skin's moisture. So it really does, your skin just feels super, super hydrated after using it. Um, and it's just honestly like, I can't, I'm actually just like so happy to have my 
my, as I said, my skin back. That's how it feels to me. And um, so I actually, my sort of skin concern that I put was to minimize pores, because that's what I really felt like when I came off the pill, my pores were just becoming so visible. Um, and that's why they were getting super clogged and like I was ending up with these breakouts. So that's what I sort of put in as my skin concern in case you guys are wondering. So there's a little update on my skincare routine and sort of how it's changed and what I'm using. Um, I have got a code for Skin and Me. If you use this, you get your first month for 350 and then it goes back to 24.99 after that for every month. But um, I think that's so reasonable because for how well this product has worked, for only 24.99 a month, I just think, I mean, I've spent a lot more on other products that have done a lot less. Today is the day of the SLA influencer event and I am so excited. We've been planning this now for like about, just about two months. A lot of planning and a lot of effort has gone into this. Um, and I'm really excited. I feel like I'm throwing my child like a first birthday party. That's honestly the equivalent of what I assume this must feel like. <laughs> SLA will be three in June. Um, but this is just the first time where I've really felt like we've launched something and I've wanted to do something a little bit more around it. So um, I'm really excited to see the venue because we've got loads of like loads of flowers. We've got this big like flower art sort of installation thing that was going up. Um, I just can't wait to see everyone and just celebrate SLA Swim because it's so exciting. And I feel like the launch is tomorrow. And although the launch is obviously sort of the most stressful part, I feel like we've come such a long way from designing it and all the things that have gone into it, like the campaign shoot and just all of that. So I'm looking forward to just trying to actually just celebrate it today and have a good time and not think about the launch tomorrow and not stress myself out and just enjoy today. Um, but I'll just show you what I'm wearing. So I've got on the little Positano beach dress. I thought I would wear some of the swim collection. It seemed right. So the way I wear this when I'm wearing it like in the daytime rather than over swimwear is I actually just tit tape the top of the dress. So this is like taped in. I haven't got a bra on, but if you tit tape it because of the chiffon material, it literally will not move. But it's also kind of crazy because I also am getting a flight to Dubai tonight to surprise my sister for her 30th birthday. Uh, with Joe, so it's a little bit of a whirlwind day, shall we say, because I'm literally doing the event, coming back home, getting in a taxi, going to Heathrow Airport. But it's fine. I love a, I love a slightly stressful day. It keeps me going. I also love the back of this dress. I think it's so nice. It's just like a nice sort of. I mean, I said it before and I'll say it again. But I do love anything backless. Um, and the print, obviously, goes without saying, this print is just an absolute vibe. Look at these two babies. We've got painters painting the front of the house and they are not happy about it. You're a little bit stressed out, aren't you? And I'm a bit worried about the fact that I'm gonna have to leave you. Nelly's looking so unimpressed. Oh dear, you're not enjoying all these noises. So I think I'm gonna wear these heels today, which are from Naked, I absolutely love them. And that's because I'm actually wearing over the top. Don't get too annoyed at me, guys. This is an unreleased SLA Blue Kenzie blazer. Um, so it's not available, but it may be available. We just didn't do it in blue, um, but it is an absolute dream and it looks particularly cute over the Positano beach dress, but <laughs> please don't hate me because it's not actually, it's not, it's kind of like a one-off sample this, but um, I thought, you know, seeing as I own the brand, I can treat myself and wear the one-off sample to the lunch. It is basically taking an army, but the SLA swim event is ready to go and I'm really excited. This is Neve and Hannah in the background here. Um, it honestly looks insane. We've got like all the stickers on the walls. We've got these mirror stickers as well saying hashtag SLA swim. And you've got the palm tree one on that side. Bags of flowers for everyone for afterwards. We've got the swim collection over here and some other SLA goodies. A bit windy down this end but be fine. Obviously the insane flower arch at the end and it's so great at Daphne's because they've got these umbrellas, which is why we booked it. So we've like hung up the bikinis like you would if you're on a beach and like the way you would let your bikinis dry. So I thought just to add a little bit of the decoration, but then we've got the place, place settings, a little bio on SLA Swim, then some prints from the campaign, the menu, and just more flowers because why not? Everyone, can I just say thank you so much to each and every one of you for coming because I don't think you understand how much it means. Um, I honestly, I was laughing this morning saying, I feel like it's my child's first birthday party because that is actually what I'm assuming it feels like when you've got a baby. I'm sure Cece will tell me completely otherwise. Um, but I'm just, 
wanted to say, if you've supported SLA so far, thank you so much, because it means the world to me. And I'm so excited to have you all here to celebrate the launch of the brand new SLA Swim. Yay! It's a really exciting venture for SLA, and I'm really hoping you guys love it, because I'm obsessed with the collection, and I hope you all will be too. Um, so yeah, enjoy your food, and thank you all so much for coming. Yeah. 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 Yes. I know, I know, all very exciting. I don't, I don't know if anyone remembers Alma. Alma was in blue last year, but she's coming out in pink this oh, year. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I feel like I'm on a shopping oh, channel. <laughs> Can you see how we've got seven orders coming in? Yeah, right? yeah. Obviously, you guys have all seen Champagne I Beat the Machine Woo! in real life. Yeah. Yeah. She is amazing. Yeah. Like, her yeah. sequin is really quite special. Also, I do name them all after actual people because they are my children. So where's my Anne? <laughs> Yeah, so. Anyways, yeah, anyway, this is all turned into something. <laughs> that was great. Yeah, coming soon, guys. Guess who's um, in Dubai? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, we're in Dubai. We arrived this morning. I'm very, very tired. It's been a bit of a whirlwind. Um, we also just ordered a beer, and this has turned up. Oh, wait, no, look. Are you having a lot? Bigger than your head. Like, what? That's not a pint, it's claiming it's a pint, but it's not a pint. I don't believe them. It's super pints in Dubai. Also, it's hot here, so surely that's going to get like hot. Um, we've come to, well, where are we? Where are we? But by the way, neither Joe or I have, well, you've been to Dubai before, but you came when you were like a young, young and, um, and I've never been. People always find that really weird as well. I don't know, maybe I look like someone who, what's this little bit we're doing? Maybe I look like someone who would go to Dubai. But, um, yeah, so we are now spending the day being incognito before surprising my sister later. So um, we'll try not to get shit face on these because. They're all goblets. It's about the same size as your head as well. Like, what? Oh. Wild. <laughs> nice. This is nice, yeah. Was it nice. called Ho Garden? Ho Garden, yeah. This is the view that we're currently looking at. It's very exciting. Love coming to a new spot. This is Ula. Ula. Oh, that was what it's called, yeah. Ula on Ula. the arm. Yeah. So, Ula does gyros, which are just like the best things ever. We love gyros. We've got a lamb and a chicken one and some prawns and some halloumi. They kind of do a whole different bunch of cuisines here, but. Anything European. Yeah. Pretty much. Okay, guys, it's happening. It is the beginning of the surprise. I'm in the truth. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Apparently mum's telling me she still has no idea, although I'm convinced that someone's let it slip, but I will know from her reaction as to whether she actually knows or not. Sorry, I'm just trying to, trying to face the light, you know. Um, oh, something's bitten my freaking ankle. Mosquitoes love me. Um, so we've come to a restaurant called Pai Thai, which we've got to get a little boat to, so that's what we're about to do. But we've come so early, because I was like, we are not, missing this we've got to be there by the time so there's a lot of pressure being a surprise for someone we've nailed it you can't you can't like mess it up we've got that know? nice and early we're ready yeah i'm also wearing an sla havana beach shirt to dinner tonight it's very i'm just actually just great dressed up all down guys it's very versatile present it's all very exciting um she's got i've got her some fendi sunglasses that she asked for so she's gonna be all there uh, decked out and this is where we're getting our little boat from such a cute way to get to dinner. Yeah. Don't forget the box. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? Like we were laughing saying if we turned up late and then we actually got on the same boat as them, that would actually ruin the surprise. So that's why we're doing it now. We're on the boat. Yeah. It's happening. The canals. It's gonna be quite the long wait when mum actually does text us to say we're here. We're gonna be like, right, so they got them on the boat. It's quite the This is amazing. Look at this. Oh my God, what a way to get to dinner. This is very exciting. I can't believe this is a hotel. This is wild, it's huge. And here we have it. The full fit. The full fit. I do love this shirt though in the evening because the material of these Havana shirts is so nice. It's got like a luxe 
like high shine to them. So even though they're beach shirts, you can wear them in the evening because they kind of look a bit like sassy. Well, it's working. It's okay, Definitely working. Oh my God. <laughs> what? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> She's such a crier. <laughs> Um, food, 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 surprise. How did you feel knowing that we weren't coming but we're here? I mean, I was very shocked. Kate's on her fourth birthday cake of five. Five birthday cakes of the week. This is what happens when you have so many surprises. So you would have liked the one that Kate had for her birthday. What was it? Because it had uh, Reese peanut cups in it. Oh, nice. And Kinder Bueno bars. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's what it really is. That is about that. Yeah. And the only, the only thing that was wrong was Ferrero Rocher. What, you don't like Ferrero Rocher? No, not really. Well, it tastes like it's made by the same people who make Kinder Bueno. And then went up on the place. Oh, what's going on? Hello. Hi. <laughs> um, so, it's actually Sunday today, and yesterday was my sister's brunch. But we had a bit of a nightmare morning, didn't we? We woke up really late. I think it's because we'd been up for literally like 24 hours and obviously had like the SLA lunch and we were both just like knackered. We needed sleep. If we didn't set our, set our alarm, we would have been so late. So we got up, had like 45 minutes to get ready and then went to the brunch. And so I just realized, literally when I went to bed very drunk last night, I thought to myself, definitely didn't vlog anything. But I've got vlog footage, but I just didn't like speak at all um but it was really good fun i might just put it in over the top here we went to um what's it called mamazonia mamazonia it was like a jungle brunch um and it was hilarious because obviously my parents were there and it was the weirdest thing going to like a lit brunch with your parents They're like loving it. they were big simon was having a great time i think he was so shit-faced by the time he left <laughs> he was like I think it needed to be carried out. Yeah, they left though, but to be fair, they uh, they did actually leave at like half four, didn't they? They left before it got too yeah. too rowdy. Um, I mean, as you can see, I haven't got any like, I said, no, I don't think I took any like horizontal footage, but I've got some other footage which I'll put in here of them. They just honestly had me howling. They were on top form. <laughs> they were really, to be fair. The Ashcrofts love a party and we love a drink, so. Yeah, everyone's on top form, actually. Yeah. Um, we're feeling it today, but we, our flight's not until like really early Monday morning. It's like 2 a.m. Monday morning. So we've got the whole day. So I said to Joe, we should go to a beach club and I've decided to book Drift Beach Club because everyone tells me it's like one of the best ones in Dubai. So we're just going to go there and chill for the day um, before I fly home very, very late on today. Glorious. Yeah, which is going to be quite nice because I really feel like I just want to do nothing and eat food. I haven't really been out in the sun either. No. Yeah. Well, it's because it's fucking hot. It is fucking hot. <laughs> like, why is my sister's birthday in May? Why can't it be in December? <laughs> This is my outfit of the day. Okay, do you wanna know something really stupid? <laughs> Guess who launched swimwear on Friday and then forgot to bring any of the swimwear actually with her to Dubai? So we did a man mad panic rush to H&M, didn't we, yesterday, so I could get some swimwear to wear for today. But this bikini top's actually really cute. It's like a glittery fabric. Um, so, yeah, no idea. But my sister's got her SLA swim with her. I mean, she's, her and Dave, her fiance, are coming to meet us at the beach club. So I'm going to make her get out of her bikini so I can take a picture in Dubai in SLA swim. <laughs> and then put, I'll put this one back on. I was like, I can't come to Dubai, which is the first time here, and not take a picture in SLA swimwear while I'm in Dubai. So Kate's kind of helped me out there. Don't know which one she's got. I think she's got the Positano print. Yeah. Oh my god, I've got to show you guys something. Yeah. So I haven't been able to actually vlog or show these because they didn't arrive to the warehouse until literally the day of launch. But these are the little um, SLA swim pouches. So every, um, like basically the first 1,000 customers who buy a bikini, you get one of these. It's like one per customer. And so your bikini comes in this, but the best thing about it is then afterwards, you can use them as like a little bag to take to the beach. So like for example, in here today, I've got like my sun cream. Uh, what else is in here? I've got a hair clip. Um, and just like a little, so you can put it in your beach bag and you know that you've got all your like lip balm, sun creams, whatever else you want to put in them. But I just thought they were quite a cute little way for the um, bikinis to arrive. So I'm, I'm, I haven't actually checked how many orders we've had on the bikinis so far. We've had quite a lot. So I'm hoping that the 1,000 customers isn't over by the time you guys see this. But 
you'll know because if you've ordered one and it comes with a bag then you're within the thousand if you haven't i'm sorry then it's over um but they are very cute and i'm hoping you guys will make good use of them i like coming somewhere new that i've never been before and i like the fact that everywhere here you've got to get to it on a golf buggy and that excites me as well here it is here we are we've arrived Look at these prawns at Drift Beach, guys. I can't even recommend them enough, hence why this is now completely empty. They were amazing. My absolute dream. This is my favourite thing in the whole entire world. When I went to Italy three years ago, I had this for breakfast and lunch every single day. <laughs> so the view here is insane. It's honestly so nice. And just like that, we're done for the day. We're now going to go off and have dinner because we've still got ages before I fly. I've done a quick outfit change. I actually didn't bring anything to wear for dinner, but I did bring a swimming costume. So I put this on with my shorts, same shirt. And it's still, it's that H&M fabric, the glittery one. So I'm back from Dubai now. We literally had the best time, um, but it was just such a whirlwind that I obviously just really wanted to spend time with my family and my sister. So I didn't vlog too much, um, but it was just so nice to see them. And like Kate was so surprised, so it just, all went really well. Um, so I'm looking really glamorous today because I actually just went along for my top up of my Tracy Giles eyebrows um, and I'm obsessed. I mean, obviously they're a lot darker than they will be right now because I've just had them done, but um, she's added in like a couple more hair strokes um, all the way along the side. So like this is literally along the side there, that is all just like eyebrow tattoo. That's like not, my, my eyebrow hair honestly stops like there. And it's just crazy how natural they've made them look. And then I also got her to just add, like you can see here, like, let me see if I can focus, oh, there you go. She's at, oh my God, this is such a funny angle. All of these front bits are hair -like, hairline strokes that they've drawn on to just create these like, basically like my dream full brow. And I'm so excited, I can't wait for them to like, they take, uh, I think I said this last time, about 10 days to heal. They get a little bit darker before they get lighter. Um, but I'm in love with the shape now. Because you, I went back for my top up because it was starting to fade slightly at the corner. But now they should, they should launch. They should last for about nine months before I need another top up. So that's really exciting. Um, they did say though, because um, a couple of you were ringing up and asking them about my brows last time I spoke about this. And they said, if it helps, just say you want Sarah Ashcroft's brows. Um, and they said that they'll use that as like this sort of technique. So don't be afraid to literally just say, um, I want Sarah Ashcroft's brows. And they'll know exactly what you mean. Um, but I can honestly, uh, uh, these are amazing. I'm obsessed, like literally obsessed. Um, and then also, while I'm here and wearing this jumper, it's made me, it's remind, I cannot speak today, my brain is not functioning. Um, it has reminded me that, when's this, oh, this vlog will be going up on Sunday, but, on, which will be today, SLA is doing, and we never do things like this, this is a Jubilee weekend special, we are doing a buy one, get one free on sweatshirts and joggers. So if you buy one sweatshirt, you get a free pair of joggers with that sweatshirt purchase, which is crazy. It's only on for a week. You only get a week to shop this and it's only while stocks last. Um, it's just like a happy birthday to the queen. Like we thought we'd treat other people to a buy one, get one free offer at SLA, which is wild. So um, I'll obviously link it below for you guys, but literally all you gotta do is buy a sweatshirt and then you get the joggers for free. If you buy two sweatshirts, you get two joggers for free. You know, you can pick, you can mix and match and do whatever you want. I'm gonna end this vlog here. As always, I hope you enjoyed this one um, and seeing the SLA influencer event, which seems like ages ago now. Um, but I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.